To set up and use your Viper XPT6000 pretreatment machine, you'll first assemble the stand in accordance with the supplied instructions and then place the unit on the stand. Once you have the unit on the stand, you'll want to connect in your tubing for the in and out lines to your pretreatment fluid and water in accordance with the directions for your desires for pretreatment. For us, we are using the Epson pretreatment solution that works best with the Epson inks. This is mixed in a 50-50 concentration, 50% of the Epson pretreatment fluid and 50% distilled water. Once you have your containers in place, the tubing inserted and power connected, we'll turn the unit on. Press the menu button and move platen in and out to get the platen in the proper position. If you wish to observe the filling and make sure all the tubes are correct, remove the cover. Place the supplied chamois on the platen. In the menu, press the fluid maintenance button. Press the fill button. Turn both valve selectors to the desired fluid position. For normal setup operations with a single pretreatment fluid, this would be the closed position for the valve, this would be the water input to the machine, number one here is indicated as pretreatment fluid input to the machine, this area here would be output to the wastewater container. Number one here is output back to the pretreatment fluid container. And number two into the machine and number two out would be used if a secondary pretreatment solution was desired. Ensure fluid lines are connected and submerged in the fluid. Press the fill button. This will fill the system with pretreatment fluid. Once complete, you can remove the chamois, replace the cover, and return to the main menu. You are now ready to perform pretreatment operations.